Thank you for the questions. I'm proud to inform you that now Tianwen number one is now orbiting around the Mars at the speed of 4.8 kilometers per second. Everything is in order. And today we have received the first local picture about the Mars in a short distance. That's the first of its kind in China that we received from the Mars. A lot of scientific information are awaiting the analysis of scientists. And in our history of discovering the solar system, Mars has always bestowed us a lot of imagination and expectation. For this moment around the world, we have conducted 47 times of such probing around the Mars, including 22 from the US, 20 from Russia. But two thirds of such Mars discovery missions failed in the past. This shows us that we have a lot of uh, difficulties in this history. But although Tianwen number one started late, we have a good start. We face a lot of challenges, but we are innovative enough. So for once and for all, we have realized the orbiting and inspection of the Mars. This will blaze a new trail of our discovery into the outer space. To guarantee its success, when Tianwen number one arrived on the Mars, we will also tour around the landing area. So we must have a good grasp of information about the landform over there, including the climatic conditions in the surroundings to avoid any fire on the Mars. And with our comprehensive analysis, in May and June this year, we will land on the Mars to continue such discovery in the later stage. Last year, we had an opportunity for Mars probing, and we have seen a lot of successes and breakthroughs in um, the Emirates and the US and China. So we are competing with each other to discover more for mankind. And we will stay open-minded to walk hand in hand with the other countries so as to contribute to building a community of shared future for mankind. Looking back at history, whether it's about developing rockets or launching the satellites or the manned spaceships or discovery in the outer space. The Chinese aerospace people have completed a lot of grand missions, and we have formed our own spirits. For example, the Beidou spirit, the deep space discovery spirit, all of those spirits are enshrined in our patriotism and our perseverance so as to climb higher in this discovery. and. They are already rooted in our DNA. Whenever we bump into difficulties or when we succeed, those spirits will send us some alert so that we will stay composed and continue such stringent requirements of ourselves. And we will also be encouraged by such spirits so that we can rise against the challenges and difficulties ahead of us. Such a spirit is the reason why China's aerospace industry could continue such glory. And this year, we are expected to launch another 40 such missions. Our space station will be constructed and our team number one will complete other discoveries and inspections of the Mars. So at this conjunction road of the two centenary goal implementation, we will continue such efforts of our ancestors to contribute to build a power, a big power of aerospace in China. Thank you, Mr. Bao.